Well, hello everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlemagne's adventure in Starmade. So, what's going on today? Ah, I didn't want to take off the helmet. I thought I had that figured out. Left click. Okay, I got my helmet on again. Yay! So let's zoom back in to first person. So what's the plan today? Well, the plan today is I think it's gonna tie. It, it's gonna be time to relocate. So what I've been doing is I've been creating this carved shabazz. Uh, let's change production here. I was building storage containers. Okay, so what were we looking for? We were looking for. Oh yeah, I was making this carved shabazz and all this stuff because this stuff you can sell you can also use this stuff if you want let's activate production there so there it continues you can actually you know use this stuff but i don't know let's I'll show you what it looks like here and then you can kind of tell you for yourself so for example um tab three no that doesn't work either okay so for example see Let's place that. So, yeah, I guess you could use it for flooring or whatever, but it's just basically just carved stone, right? So, no big deal, huh? Yeah, so I'm probably going to sell this stuff for credits because you get 30 credits for each one. So that is awesome. So that's what I'm going to do here right away. So let's get out of this building mode and let's hop on our ship. Let's, oh. Shift slows you down. <laughs> oh, that's so funny. Okay, and we go on our ship here. So, how's everyone been doing? I know I'm doing great. Let's get out of here. Okay. So, off we go. I hate leaving this place, but I put a little light there so we can find it again. So, let's go up. Um, where is... Okay, so let's go into our map here. So you just need to go to the closest shop. Uh, path to Currents. I think we can do that, right? And we get out of this. Where's the path? There we go. Okay, let's start moving forward and you head towards the shop here. And for some reason I'm getting kind of some graphical glitches not sure why I'm not sure if that's because it's just the game and it's and it's alpha state or not or but yeah but I'll see you down there when I get to the the shop okay here we go here we go here's the shop there's also an asteroid here so I'm actually gonna take a quick detour and we're actually gonna take out this asteroid here let's see what this stuff is Woo. Why is that the red stuff there? That's interesting. Let's just take a closer look at that. Ah! Okay. Well, let's salvage the crap out of this and see what we've got here. So, what kind of blocks do we have here? Lucra, probably, and red dirt. That's interesting. Okay, well, I'm going to harvest this. This rock here, I'm going to actually probably harvest the whole thing here. Probably use our mass beam. I do want to change the design of this ship a bit. Just because of the the mining beams that are on here. They're kind of crappy. So now we can kind of create our own mining beams. And yeah, so that's kind of exciting getting kind of lag right now is that because of the planet in the background so let's kind of turn around away from it yeah so that's so weird yeah I'm gonna have to mess around with my memory probably allocate more RAM if I can to the game because I think that might help with it I'm not too sure but I'm hoping <laughs> so let's just grab all these things here on the surface anyways and then we'll head to the shop to sell because this stuff is very important well sort of important i'm trying to figure out where all the materials you hide and what asteroids but 
a little bit of everything is always good. Uh, just so that way you can have the specific kinds for the specific pieces or parts that you you might need. So yeah, so it's pretty cool. But yeah, but I'll mine this and I'll see you at the shop, which is over. Where is it? I lost the shop. Right there. That's where the shop is. So that's where we'll be. So yeah, I'll see you when I'm done with this. Okay, well here we are. Let's see if we can stop here. This is kind of a weird base. Ah, crash into it. It's kind of weird bases that has the undetonators, but no actual you know, habitation module. It's kind of interesting. Not like the other one that we kind of used. So let's see. Let's see. So to sell this carved shabazz, uh, I think it's under terrain and mineral. And see carved shabazz, right? So if we click on that, go sell amount. And we have 254. We got 7,000. Bang! Look at that. We got 9,000 credits now. Woo! That's not much, but that's definitely on the way to building our own space station. What if I go B? You know, not B. How about M? No. X? No. V C? Oh, that's weird. Okay. Uh, oh, maybe we can't be in the ship. So if we pop out. And then let's say we go V, V, uh, M. Okay, so one million for a space station. Okay, that's not too bad. So that's going to take a while to accumulate, of course. Let's go back into our ship here. Okay. And yeah, so that's the, that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to fly over to those asteroids over there. And I think I'm going to... Do some more mining. Uh, where are we exactly? Let's go pee. I think those are the ones I hit before. Let's see. Okay, I thought maybe the arrow. No, I'm gonna go over to those and mine those. And so yeah, so maybe we'll throw some music on and just go from there. that sap some stuff is on I think it's on this one here let's just grab let's see here let's take a look so I have 12 saps right let's see if that is it yeah this is it okay so I'm gonna harvest some of this stuff here since we got my ship back what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna harvest and then fly back to their planet to process the materials and then I'm going to discuss kind of what's going to happen um, and then I'll build the jump drive on the ship here and I think we're going to go to our new location and that's where we're going to kind of build our, our planetary base and you know everything like that so yeah so I'm going to harvest this saps in here so that way we can create some more of those hulls so that way we can continue with creating our our place here so yeah so I'll meet you all back at the planet bye bye or well not bye bye but I'll see you later okay here we are back at our base 
And let's see if I can get in for landing. Let's see here. I think we should start to hit the atmosphere. Uh, we want to go over here. We're almost there. Rotate. Ah. Uh, ah. Uh, bang. Perfect. <laughs> Oops, wrong button. Ah. Yeah, definitely have to fix the ship. There's a few issues with it. <laughs> okay, so let's go over here. We're going to throw in all our crap. So we got some more Shabazz. Got some more Parsine Shard Raw. Some Sepsun Ore. Some Masset Ore. Nice. Some Nox Shards. We got some Ice. I think we we put those in the other box, I think. There we got some virus. Some sand. I wonder what we do with that. The lava I'm keeping. Uh, Sujil. Red dirt. I don't know if I need that for anything. Lucra. We got grass here. Some more of those guys. The ore. And that. Okay. So with that doing its thing, I need to just kind of take a look at this. And lots of Varus and Shabazz. So I th think I have an idea for what I want to do with the factory. I want to make a big ass factory so that way... I wonder if there's a way of... Oh, cancel. I wonder if there's a way... Switch to named inventory. No. Okay, I was just wondering if you could kind of you organize these a different way, but it doesn't look like that. So yeah, so basically this is what the plan is while that's all refining. I'm going to open this up. Uh, I think we can deactivate production. We're going to change production. And I think the jump drives is either this level or a level higher. Uh, yeah, okay. I think just one more higher cancel okay let's go actually let's continue to make the Shabazz uh, maybe this one will have the jump drive so this is making ice crystals I think from the ice so if I put some more ice in here oh, okay so it takes 10 okay I see so if we go change production Ah, here we go. What's this AstroTech computer for? Show block it for me. Uh, uh, so that needs a Sapson castle and a crystal composite. Hmm. Let's make one. Okay, that's made. Okay, so the AstroTech computer is required for creating functioning repair systems. Okay, so that's definitely not important. Let's change production again to, let's see, beacon, black light, blah, blah, camera. I think it's in here somewhere. Factory enhancers, we want these guys so let's build a few of these guys crystal and alloy metal mesh perfect so let's start production on this stuff we need a bunch of these guys the main purpose for these guys would be to enhance the existing factories here um, either here or at our new location i'm not sure exactly so you're here factories are more efficient by increasing the number of production active during each factory cycle which is pretty freaking cool. So while that is making that, I'm not sure how many I want of those. Maybe six would be okay, two for each, or I don't know. We can always make more, so no big deal. Let's see here. Jump drive. I want to make a jump drive because I want to get to the edge of the galaxy here. I'm kind of okay. What do we need for this one? Masset and crystal composite. Okay, cool. Let's see. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. 
Okay, what's going on here? Ah, so okay, I am very sh short on the masset. Ah, okay, I don't know if I like it how it does that. How it just it takes everything. Is that the only masset, or do I need to get more materials? Oh man, that would that would be terrible. Oh look at that! I guess so. Well, that sucks. So, the mass that I collected is nowhere near enough. Okay. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll meet you up at the shop, and we'll see if if I can buy a jump drive and some jump modules. So yeah, I will meet you up at the the shop. I'll see you there. Okay, well, here we are. I keep clicking because I click on the X and then it makes you shoot right after, which is pretty stupid. Well, this game's still alpha, so. <laughs> so let's see here. So hopefully there's a jump drive. There is a jump drive computer. Price 10,000. Oh, man. Uh, you can put them on a ship, charge them up, instant travel up to eight sectors. Destination influence two. Uh, you jump in the direction you're looking at. You can use more precise entering waypoint and navigation. Will enable to jump towards it no matter which direction you took. But to check at your waypoint sector if it's fewer than eight. Jump drives are portable. So you think I need a computer to activate it and a module to charge it? Hmm. So basically, I'm nowhere near where I need to be for that. So what can we sell? What do we have to sell? We can sell the Astrotech computer. So let's see what that will give us. Astrotech computer. Oh, okay, actually, I'll actually give us. Ah, okay. May hey, maybe, maybe, maybe. Jump drive. There we go. So we'll buy one of these, and then buy one of these. Ah, it hurts so much to buy those. Okay, and then we go space. We're in build mode. So we replace. Okay, so that that does look like. So if I go control. There we go. So if we. If we go, let's see, three. So this is the computer system, right? Okay, and it's connected to this piece, which I should be able to go control. And I'm just looking for the arrow to go the right direction, which is that direction. I'm going to put it right here. I don't think it matters where we put the jump drive, but we'll see what that does. Okay, so now my plan was, zoom out here, is to go way over, I think I can control click, or shift click, control click. Hold right mouse button to rotate, use your mouse keys, hold shift to move a system instead of a sector. So shift. Ah, okay. So we want to go... Okay, there's a star here somewhere. Maybe not, okay. So shift. Shift. Okay. Uh. Ah, uh, here we go. I think... Let's take a look at this one a little bit closer here. So I think that's three planets that should be in here. I don't see them, but okay, so there's that. If I hold the shift, go this way. Oh, look at this one. 
Huh, this one's kind of cool actually. This one has lots of stuff going for it. I wonder if I'll we'll shoot for that one. Hmm. Yeah, look at all these. Wow, that's cool. Maybe that one will be it. Let's take a look. It's it should be a planet that's not too close, not too far. I don't see a planet in that orbit anywhere. Hmm. Oh, look at that one. That's like a... Yeah, okay, maybe this is it. I think this will be it. We're going to check out these planets here. There's a bunch in here. And we're going to check this whole system out. Let's see. Yeah, I think this will be it. This will be where the Demurian Empire will lay hold. So let's see here. We need to go to a planet. So let's shoot for this part of the sector when there's nothing there uh, plot plot path to current there we go okay how far is it Ooh, 426 kilometers so how do we B C okay C just does that Okay, I don't know what that means, the orientation. Um, I'll be right back. I'm going to check the controls. Well, I think it's time to put our episode at a close here. I'm not too sure how long it's going to be. I th think it's long enough already. i kind of been watching the footage, and or not watching, but just watching how much I've been using or recording. <laughs> So thank you everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Uh, next episode what we're going to do is we're going to fly to where we're going to be. I think it's just going to take too long to, to try and... And uh, yeah, to try and build here on this planet. I'd rather be on my planet and just start building the materials that I need to expand on that base and so forth. So yeah, so thank you everybody for watching. I look forward to seeing you in the next episode. And have a great day. Bye-bye.